Hello and welcome to this latest update on the upcoming Europa League clash between Barcelona and Manchester United. As we approach the big game, both teams have been dealing with their fair share of injury problems, and there's a lot to unpack, so let's get started. Barcelona have been dealt another blow as midfielder Sergio Busquets was forced to leave the field after just eight minutes in their La Liga match against Sevilla. This is a huge setback for Xavi's side, who were already struggling with the absence of Ausmane Dembel. Frank Kessie was brought on to replace Busquets, but it remains unclear if the experienced player will be able to make a return for the Europa League match against Manchester United, with Dembel expected to be out until March, Xavi will have to come up with some creative solutions to fill the gap. Meanwhile, Eric Ten Hag has been challenging Manchester United forward Alexandro Garnacho to step up his game and start scoring more goals. Ten Hag feels that Garnacho has the potential to be a star player for the team, but he needs to be more clinical in front of goal. And while Manchester United midfielder Casemiro was sent off during their recent match against Crystal Palace, he will still be available for the Europa League game against Barcelona, however, the team will likely be without Anthony Marshall and Scott McTominay for the first leg, as Ten Hag's injury problems continue. Ten Hag believes that the workload on players from having a World Cup in the middle of the season is one of the reasons for the high number of injuries this season. He acknowledged that this has been a tough season for players and that the load has been too much. So, as we prepare for this exciting clash between two of the biggest teams in the world, it will be interesting to see how both teams overcome their injury problems and who will come out on top. The first leg is set to take place on February 16th in Spain, with the return leg taking place on February 23rd at Old Trafford. We'll be keeping a close eye on all the developments leading up to the game, so stay tuned. Thank you so much for watching this video, if you enjoyed it, please be sure to like, share, and subscribe to stay up to date on all of our future content, your support means the world to us, and we hope to continue bringing you entertaining and informative videos for a long time to come, thanks again, and we'll see you in the next one.